even if your phone no longer receives official over-the-air firmware updates from your OEM or your wireless carrier, it's still getting new features, bug fixes, and security vulnerabilities patched. This is thanks to the weekly Google Play system updates, which was recently renamed to Google System Services Updates. So let's take a look at what started rolling out this week. You'll notice that the Google Play Services application will receive an update to version 25.40. And once that has been installed, those with an Android smartphone should notice that you can pair Bluetooth low energy audio devices with multiple parts, even though they don't communicate internally. There will be a new page within the security and privacy section of the settings application that will now show apps that have asked for an advanced protection state. And I think that one will be interesting to take a further look at. And they've released a small update for both Google and third-party app developers to help them support Maps-related processes better. This week, we're also seeing an update pushed out for the Google Play Store application that will bring it up to version 48.4. This update is rather small this week, but those who have installed it should receive some sort of notification at some point or another. And that notification will ask you to set your preferences when it comes to a more personalized notification experience. And this one seems rather vague too. So if any of you end up getting that notification, we would greatly appreciate it if you shared those details in the comments here directly under this video. I would like to start a new community questions video here on the channel. So if you're having trouble with your Android smartphone or tablet, or maybe you just have a question about Android in general, then send in an email to questions at explainingandroid.com. It seems as if these updates pushed out by Google this week are a little sparse. And that makes me wonder if the majority of the folks working on Android currently are busy getting ready for the next major release. If you ended up seeing one of those new features already, be sure to let us know about it. And please do not forget to give this video a like, click on that new hype button that YouTube has been advertising lately, and subscribe to the channel too if you haven't done so already.